Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will learn how to install Eclipse current version that is Eclipse 2023-03 on Windows. For that, go to the web browser. I am using Chrome. You can use any web browser. On Google, type Eclipse and press Enter. Open the official website. Open the official website. Eclipse.org. Now click download. Now we will reach the downloads folder. Here it is. Here you can see the current version is visible. And it's written that you don't need to install Java separately to install this. It comes pre installed now. No problem. Click on download. x86 underscore 64 means means for 64 bit OS. Here is the exe file. You can click download here. Now the download should start. It started. 1 double 2 MB, let's wait. Guys, you have downloaded it. Double click on it to install. Minimize. The different Eclipse ID versions are now visible. For Java, this. For C, C++. For PHP here. I'll go for Eclipse ID for Java developers. Click on it. On clicking now you can see it automatically took the Java version because it comes pre-installed. The installation folder is the following. You can change it if you want. But I'll keep the same. It will also create a start menu and a desktop shortcut. Click install. Installing. Let's wait. Guys, we have installed it. It also it created a desktop shortcut. Directly click on launch. Now it is asking to select a workspace. So workspace is a place where in all your project files, folders and plugins gets saved. So you can select any location for it. But I'll keep this. Let's say I'll name it Amit. Amit Eclipse workspace, which is fine. You can set it as default so that you don't need to set so that you don't need to set the workspace again and again. Click launch. This will launch Eclipse for the first time. Eclipse started for the first time. Now let us quickly create our first project. I'll go to file. I'll go to file, click new. Click uh, Java project. Project name, add any name. It will get saved under our workspace. If you remember, this was our workspace and this is our project. Execution environment, keep it as it is. This was given by our own, uh, this was provided by our own Eclipse only. Rest keep as it is and click next. Finish. Project now our projector is ready. Here it is. You can now you can now right click new class name the class. Let's say Amit package. Let's say com dot studiopedia. Rest I'll just select publish static environment. Click finish. Now we created an Amit file. I'll just print something quickly using system dot. out dot print so I printed this file save all forgot the semicolon file save all again now right click click run as java application and this will run successfully so guys in this video we saw how we can install the how we can install the current Eclipse version. We also 
created our first Java project on Eclipse. Thank you for watching the video.